What's up? In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to download video footage from Artlist, like stock video footage, get it into Premiere Pro so you can start editing with it. All right, so if you watch this video, here we have a section where we do want to include stock footage. I guess I'm going to be bringing you through the four stages of life. All right, four stages of life. We want to find a stock footage that will go well with this. So if we jump over to artlist.io, you can see here, if we click the search icon in the top left corner, we can select this drop down menu and let's go ahead and select footage. And then let's just go ahead and type in life. All right, you can give it a keyword. Uh, you can give it you know, any sort of feedback that you'll want to. And then you're gonna be able to start seeing you know, different images pop up. Now we might need to give it a little bit more relevance I'm seeing four stages of life, four stages of life. Let's say, let's say a tree, all right? Tree of life, everybody kind of thinks of trees being awesome and full of life. Okay, this is like a little bit more of what we're looking for. We just want one that Something like this is great. Yeah, that, that will be good. All right. <clears throat> and then we're going to download this. All right. So once you find your perfect stock footage, you're going to want to hover over it in art list. And then there's a little download icon far right corner. You're going to want to click that. This is going to pop up the options at which you can download this. So you got HD 4K MP4. 4K MP4 is what I want to click that's going to work with Premiere Pro. Go ahead and select whatever folder you would like to download this to, press save, and this is going to immediately download, in this case, to my Chrome browser extension. But you're going to be able to locate this file once it's fully downloaded and just go ahead and drag it into Premiere Pro. So I'm going to take this file, I'm going to drag it over my Premiere Pro icon, and now I can go ahead and just bring it onto any layer of my Premiere Pro project. I'm going to zoom up and just you know, go ahead and um, move this over so that it perfectly fits the light flare here. And I'm going to drop a cut with my razor tool. I press C or grab my razor tool, press V or come back and grab my selection tool. And now let's just delete the rest of that stock footage. And now I can take it and drag it down. All right. So now we have change the stock footage or you could have done this for the first time added stock footage into your premiere pro project from artlist